five. A Master Hunter five. It's uh, very surreal. Yeah. Um, we had a rough start when we first started running together. He broke seven tests in a row. <laughs> I uh, thought about giving him back to the guy I bought him from, but oh, yeah. he talked me out of it. Yeah. We've had a great ride ever since. He's um, an incredible dog. He's sweet, easy to deal with. He's a great market dog. What's his name? His name is Jones. He um, a little bit of a singer, howler monkey when he was younger, so yeah. we named him after George Jones. <laughs> um, but uh, we're going for our sixth here, and really, he's going strong. Yeah. Uh, so hopefully we'll get through this last series. And how old is he now? He's ten and a half. Wow. So he's getting up there. So. You probably only have maybe one or two more left in him, huh, for nationals? Or is this his last one, or are you still hoping to get a couple more? Well, we know that he already has a little bit of arthritis, and yeah. uh, he's had a great career. He basically has done everything I've asked him to do. We ran one qual. We got in the colors. We He's a MNH4. Oh. We've had a little bad luck at the Master National, sure. but he's a five here, and I don't think there's anything I've ever asked him to do that he hadn't given his whole heart to make it happen for me. Is this me. the first dog you've had in the Hall of Fame? This is the first dog I've had yeah. in the Hall of Fame. Well, that's pretty impressive. So. so That's a lot of time, money, and commitment, right? It's a lot of time and money but and commitment. Yeah. We've met some wonderful people from all over the United States doing this. Yeah. And really, it's we're retired. Our kids are all grown and gone, so it's been an incredible opportunity to see the country and meet yeah. some great people.